Oh, man, let's talk about it. You guys probably woke up to the unfortunate news just like I did, right? Finding out that Pop Smoke lost his life in L.A. Now, you guys know, right? A rising New York artist decided to go out to L.A. And unfortunately, from what's being reported, an alleged gang hit was placed on his life. Now, from what TMZ is reporting is that the family speaking out and they want to know what's going on in this situation just like us, right? It seems like everyone is searching for answers in this horrible situation that happened, right? Now, it's being reported right now that the family had no clue that Pop Smoke had any enemies in L.A., right? And that would probably make sense of why he was there, like, so freely, having fun, and this and that. Maybe he didn't know he had enemies, right? Now, they also don't believe that someone would have followed him from New York to L.A. Because they say, look, if anything was going to happen to him in New York, that's where he was there 99% of the time. It would have already happened to him. Why would they follow him from L.A. to New York if that's the case, right? Now, the family's also speaking out, and they said that he was in L.A., right, trying to promote his new mixtape. He was relaxing for a little bit, and at some point, he was going to go on tour in March. So that would make sense of why he would go out to L.A. He's trying to wind down, right? He's trying to get his mixtape popping on the West Coast. And the unfortunate situation happened. After this went down, the family, they're searching for answers in the situation. So they're talking to the people that was there. They're talking to any friends. And they're trying to piece together any information that they can to find out what happened. Like I told you guys, the people that was there have been questioned by the police and From what TMZ is reporting, the family have also reached out to those people and they have questioned them as well to try to gather any information that they can. Now, piggybacking off what I said earlier, when the family said that they had no clue that Pop Smoke had any enemies in L.A., it's possible that he didn't even know that. (laughs) You know, like, listen, this this situation is crazy. And I was talking to someone today and I had a conversation with them and You know, we were going back and forth with this, right? And I ended up telling the person that I'm not sure if we may ever find out what happened in the situation. This may go down as one of those unfortunate events that happened to Biggie or Tupac where we're sitting there scratching our heads 10 to 15, 20 years from now saying, man, what happened there? And people are still speculating about the situation because this seems like one of those tight lip things going on where some people in the streets may know, but the rest of the world may not find out. And I hope that's not the case, especially for his family. I mean, looks like he has a, a very loving family and a group of friends that, uh, that care about him. Now, now you guys know when this whole thing went down, People on the internet were going crazy. They started to point fingers at Mike D. Now, come to find out, Mike D is actually Pop Smoke's brother. Now, he responded to the people that was in his comments blaming him for this whole situation, which we then reported on. And this is what he had to say addressing those people that was pointing the finger at him. Can nothing express the pain I'm feeling? I just lost my brother, my heart, my dogs. You guys have no type of sense of sympathy. Y'all don't know what's going on. Y'all come here playing investigator and bashing me on the internet. I would never in my life set my brother up. We ate together. We broke bread together. This really my mother child. I don't got to explain nothing to nobody that don't know me. But for the ones who know me, know when you saw me, you saw pop. We live in such a messed up society. Y'all got to wake up. Just know I got you forever, brother. The truth will come to light until then. Sleep in peace. That's what his brother had to say about this whole situation. You know, it, it's an unfortunate situation. Uh, Mike seems like a good guy. And he has been getting a lot of heat over the internet. My condolences goes to Mike and his family. 
you know, I just think a lot of people right now, they're searching for answers. And the reason that Mike was, was getting it so tough is that, you know, people were upset. So when those people were upset, they started to point fingers at people. They felt like he was the one that leaked the address. So, you know, they started to go at him and blame. And it's just like that may not even be the case of what led to what happened to Pop Smoke, man. Like at some point, hopefully the truth is going to come out. My condolences goes to his family. I hope they find what they're looking for. Um, unfortunately, nothing's going to bring back Pop Smoke. Anyway, you guys be safe out there. I love you guys. I'm Dom is live and I'm out. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and I will continue to update you guys as this goes on. Hopefully we find out something.